Hello, I'm Gilles Mancio. I'm sorry, I've got this memory problem. I have this, this old phone and I'm recording everything on it. And sometimes it's like cut me off in my second video. So I just want to return to this, this exercise that the Archangel Michael, um, please watch the first part. I'm going to put it, uh, put it along as well to, to, re to do this exercise where we return to the wounds to do a meditation to call on your guides and and to see to, to it's not about the circumstances or the physical appearance but what was your first thought and emotion when you first born what was the energy what was um, thoughts and in thoughts emotion can be changed as well as reality but it is a um, it is very important to 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 realize that to, to, because early childhood is very important it imprints us with all this is when the process of ascension starts with when we were born and, and it's also about um to uh, to um to understand that everything was planned, but the emotion is was and is the thoughts and what we experienced when we were born were really uh, it's not part of our memory bank, but but it's been recorded and so we can go back in meditation and also about uh, um, uh, healing childhood trauma for childhood trauma for me I, I'm really, I was fortunate that my mother adored me and I had a very pleasant childhood and and even um, teenage years i was very uh, had a lot of friends and women like the girls like me and i was very uh, i had a very privileged chi childhood and teenage years but I, there is still tra trauma traumas my mother explained to me one thing that when i was very young one year and a half just to illustrate that we all have that part of our memory back and we need to heal it just as an example we were living in Paris on the first floor, and, and my mother was opening the door. I was I was just starting to walk, and, and she was opening the door, and I started walking, and I, I went down the whole flight of stairs, and she was completely panicked with the hospital. So that was I was no injured or anything. My guardian angel took care of that. But even to that day, when I see somebody falling down to the ground, I experience the the, the pain of the impact. Even when I watch a movie, uh, uh, stunt men uh, doing their their stunts and falling down, I experience the the feeling of the impact that of them feeling into the floor so i see this is this is a, a trauma from early childhood that needs to be healed so it's important to 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 continue to cultivate this 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 to, to reintegrate this memory to return to that point if you can also understanding in the relationship to the soul plan that we have soul mates people we have come into intimate relationship usually the soul mates are it's because we have chosen to to support each other for personal level on the professional level, on a spiritual level, to fulfill each other's life purpose. And very often those soulmates with his souls that we've been doing that together with in many, many past lives before. Um, and sometimes there are karmic patterns. People come together to, to harmonize. There is not just love and joy. It's because they need to, organ, to, to reorganize, to balance out energy from lifetime, from all patterns. The more positive we have, the more we are attracting positive. The more negative, we are attracting negative. So just continue to focus on, on being um, as positive in your in relationship as with yourself as well with others eh? and uh, for our god self for those who can realize we have this god self this gift of the great i am presence that is a gift from god is the greatest teacher we can ever invoke or call on for he knows us so much better than anyone else even ourselves it knows us better than ourselves and sometimes this this i am presence needs to when we're ready to point out to our weakness to point out to our mistakes for at the beginning when the, when this happens we judge we condemn ourselves we become very severe with the the process of like being exposed to some of our weaknesses the ego does not like it because the ego does not never recognize failure so but it's very important to recognize our mistake to to, to work towards uh, stopping them and then to fix the consequences of our mistake to bring our life into balance for we're doing many many things that are completely right completely in harmony completely uh, uh, b completely loving but there are also things that we need to work on and so i just wanted to congratulate yourself accept that you are enough but also accept that the fact that there is all there is things to work on to improve yourself and to become a, a better version each and every day well i hope this message was interesting for you i thank you very much for continuing to to, to subscribe if it's not if you're not a subscriber welcome to all the new subscribers thank you very much for continue to following this those messages if you if you've been following them for a while i thank you for liking and sharing and commenting and uh, i'm going to finish with a song it's um it's it's a, it's a song that uh, that talks about uh, every day we need to climb up a stair huh? it's like uh, there are mountains in our way it's it's an old song uh, it was sung by joe cooker and jennifer Warnes. it goes like this 
Who knows what tomorrow brings? In a world few hearts survive. All I know is the way I feel. When it's real, I keep it alive. The road is long. There are mountains <coughs> in our way. But we climb a step every day. Love lifts us up where we belong. Far from the world below, up where the clear winds blow. Some hang on to used to be, live their lives looking behind. All we have is here and now. All our lives are there to find. The road is long. There are mountains in our way, but we climb a step every day. Love lifts us up where we belong, where the eagles cry on a mountain high. Love lifts us up where we belong, far from the world we know, where the clear winds blow. Time goes by, no time to cry. Life's you and I alive. Today, love lifts us up where we belong, where the eagles cry on a mountain high. Love lifts us up where we belong, far from the world we know. Where the clear winds blow, love lifts us up where we belong. Where the eagles cry on a mountain high, love lifts us up where we belong. Great song yeah, from the movie, I think. And so I, I wanted just to come and there's this fly that she really loves me. She's like hanging out. I'm going to have to give her a name. Maybe I'm going to adopt her. She didn't have a very long life, but I don't want to get too attached to, to it. And uh, so I wish you a wonderful day. And I thank you very much. Have a nice.